Hello everyone, and welcome to day 128 of playing Persona 4 Golden in real time. The series where I play the in-game date on the same date in real life, one day at a time. So, get ready, we've got a very exciting episode for you today. Time's going to be flying by before your eyes, so I hope you didn't leave the oven on. But, let's go ahead and jump into it to see what the gang is up to today. So, let's get synced up. And, alright, that's going to wrap up the gameplay portion of today, and bring us on to Shuffle Time. So today's card is the Hermit card in the upright position. So let's go ahead and see what that means fate has in store for us. Why don't you tell us more about that, Igor? The Hermit is a seeker for the knowledge that comes from within. A lonely wanderer in the path of the night, he searches for that which can only be gained with long periods of solitude, the inner voice. To hear it, he must disconnect from the crowds whose voices and desires threaten to overcome his own. He walks through the dark night of his unconscious, guided only by the low light of the northern star, with his destination being his home, his self. You are currently contemplating that you need to be alone. Never be afraid to take this chance to reflect, as it could help you clear your mind of all the clutter that comes with everyday life. The Hermit may also refer to your effort in taking action that is authentic and aligned with your true <coughs> self. You are perhaps searching your inner soul for guidance on what is right and where your next steps are to be. The Hermit's appearance in a reading can also denote the appearance of someone who will come to your life that will be your mentor. Okay, so pretty good message. I think there's a lot of interpretations that this can have, but... Seems like the first part of just kind of ignoring the noise, listening to yourself, I think, is something that feels a bit more relevant, although I'm sure it's been relevant across eons, that rather than listen to the crowd and kind of go with the flow of what everyone else is doing, listen to yourself and do what you think is what you should be doing. And I feel it feels more prevalent with social media, all these things trying to distract you or fight for your attention, to just kind of turn that, like, you know, just ignore it. Focus on what you think is worth your time and how it should be spent, and just kind of pursue that. And so I think the Hermit, it definitely doesn't come off as a very... Definitely not something that you strive for to be like, yeah, I want to be a Hermit. But I, I think rather than being, like, outcast from society, just not needing it and being content on your own, following your own path, I think it's definitely something that is admirable and worth striving for. So, whatever that is for you, whatever you think is worth doing, that maybe not everyone... I don't want to say not necessarily that everyone agrees with, but even if someone else wouldn't do that themselves, that doesn't mean that it's not right for you. So, I think just staying, listening to yourself, not trying to follow the trends or what other people are doing, just thinking internally, reflecting, and what you think is best is probably a good way to go. So... That's going to be another card down and another day done. We've got a few more days of this very quick acceleration, just skipping a week. But I'll continue to do shuffle time as usual, so I hope you guys will tune in and follow along. But feel free to subscribe if you'd like to follow along with the journey as I do this every day. But either way, thanks for watching. I truly appreciate it. I'll see you guys tomorrow.